When someone is seriously burned, they face a number of health challenges. In order to close the wound, doctors graft skin from other parts of the body, creating more wounds and increasing the risk of infection. Ursula Perry reports now a new system helps patients regenerate new skin. Come with you. Come here. Tacey Gash's whole life changed in five minutes on Memorial Day 2018 when her family home exploded. Stacy and her husband Bill had just come home from grocery shopping when they noticed there was a strong smell of gas. I remember the click. I remember the whoosh of air because it was really hot, strong whoosh of air. And I remember seeing pink. When I woke up in the hospital, I had burn marks that came around, looked like somebody done like that to my face. And it's because of the fire had come around, clapped my face and then moved on. The flames burned Tacey on 20% of her body. Her hands and legs were the worst. The heat had melted her skin to the carpet. During her two weeks in the hospital, doctors recruited Tacey for a clinical trial of Resell. It's a kit containing everything a doctor needs to take a small sample of a patient's own skin and turn it into a liquid with the cells needed to regrow new skin. Then it gets sucked up into a syringe and then the syringe is outfitted with an atomizer so that you can spray it on. Tacey says the areas treated with the spray skin healed flatter and the color is better than her burns that were treated with skin grafts from other areas of her body. With Resell, a piece of healthy skin the size of a postage stamp can treat a burn 80 times that size. It means less donor sites for the patients, which means decreasing their total wound burden. Tacey's husband did not undergo the spray-on skin procedure. His burns were just too severe. It's covering 60% of his body. That said, they are both still recovering. As for the procedure itself, Resell was actually approved by the FDA last year. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News.